Hi, hello everyone. Welcome to my channel, Indian Mom Cooking. So today's recipe is tomato gravy, or in Tamil they will call it as takali topka. It's very easy to make as well. And let's get started with the ingredients now. So here I've taken three medium-sized onion and I've uh, chopped them finely. And also I've taken three medium-sized tomatoes, and I'm going to blend these tomatoes. So I've cut them into big chunks. So now I'm going to blend this tomato. So I've just blended the tomatoes. So I'm going to use three green chilies here. So I'm using refined oil here. So I'm going to take about three tablespoons of refined oil and let them heat. So now the oil is hot enough. I'm going to start off by adding one spoon of mustard seeds and then followed by one spoon of urad dal and let them pop and the urad dal turn its color to brown just give it a nice stir So now the urad dal turned its color to brown. I'm going to add in the curry leaves. And then followed by the finely chopped onions. And then the slittered green chilies. So now I'm going to add little salt. And just give it a quick stir and I'm going to close the lid and cook this for about five minutes or until the onions are nicely softened so it's been five minutes so the onions are nicely softened and now it's time to add in the tomato puree So give it a nice stir and keep the flame on medium and close the lid and cook it for again 5 more minutes. So now the tomatoes are nicely cooked. Now we can add the dry masalas. So starting off I am going to add about 2 spoons of Kashmiri chilli powder and then one spoon of plain chili powder and then followed by one spoon of pepper powder one spoon of cumin powder and then half a spoon of turmeric powder and then nicely mix it all together so now at this stage I am going to add about half a cup of water here so this is the container which I blended my tomatoes. So I've just added half a cup of water, giving it a good stir. And now again I'm going to close the lid and cook it until the masalas are nicely cooked or otherwise you can just leave it for 5 to 10 minutes. So it takes about 5 to 10 minutes. So it's been 10 minutes. So now the tomato gravy is nicely cooked. As you can see the oil has separated from the mixture. This indicates it has nicely cooked. So now I am going to add the required salt. So remember uh, we have already added some salt at the beginning. So now I am going to add the required amount of salt for the tomato gravy. So tomato gravy is ready. And finally I am going to garnish it with some freshly chopped coriander leaves so this is how simple easy recipe uh, you can uh, you can eat this tomato gravy with hot steamed rice or chapati or puri or dosa idli so it complements with any dishes so i hope you like this video this is how simple easy to make tomato gravy 
and you can store this gravy for three to four days in the refrigerator it stays well 